What? I don't know where you're going with this. This is we're the trying channel. We're not talking about Star Wars celebration. Is that happening right now? I think in Europe. Yeah. I mean, this is America, sir. As Chavez Camino says, this is America. We're global. This channel okay. is global, sir. We got fans. Wait, all over this channel the or the other channel? No, this channel. Huh? Okay. Yeah, we got fans all over the world, man. Okay. Like Soul Train said, all over the world. Fantastic. Uh, that's Leroy and Michael. And uh, I mean, we got a couple of trailers we're going to react to tonight. I'm going to do a little Russian roulette and just pick one here. Yeah, I don't know what's going to like, I, go. So for those of you playing at home, I know what four things we're going to watch. I just don't know what order they're in. So it's just going to come up. I'm going to close my eyes. Mm -hmm. And then Michael's just going to play it. And then we're going to, you know, react and see okay. what it is and then talk about it. Okay, close your eyes. Here we go. All right, you can open them. Here we go. All right. Um, man, you messed up because I could have saw it in the corner. Oh, well, yeah, <laughs> there we go. How long we have been underground. Oh. Oh. Or who built the silent. Common. Actually, You're still trying to act, huh? Hey, 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 Common can act. You shut you your mouth. You do not know why there is no life outside okay. the silo. Hey, girl. That's my boo, Rebecca Ferguson. Lady Jessica. We only know that here is safe. And there is not. Oh, that dude. Have you ever noticed anything strange? Every day. I don't live silent. underground. Some mysteries are best left unsolved. They storm the Capitol too. What's the big question? What if everything you know to be true is a lie? Was one big lie. I knew it. So what's the lie? Is this a Truman Show type thing where they're being watched and this is an experiment and they've just like had generations of people living in like an ant farm and they're just seeing how it happens. Are they cooking people? Is that what's going on? Are we eating people? Or is the world not destroyed and you can actually go outside? I, in my mind, I think it's that last one. You can go outside? I, th I think you can go outside. I'm hoping it's the first one. Okay. I'm hope like, think about that. Like that would be a total mind fuck. Like you, your whole society, you've been thinking you're living underground. This is the world is destroyed. And then you find out this has been all for fucking show. Sure. Man, I tell you what, I'd be one mad motherfucker. <laughs> uh, you said you were picking up IMDb. Who's in this cast? So we saw Common. Uh, put some respect on Common's name. <laughs> I don't know that I can. Really? And here's a, a comment's fine. He's a better actor than me, and I guess that's all you really got to be. But still, I mean, um, that's not saying much. I mean, <laughs> okay, that was Tim Robbins. Okay, I was like, who is that white dude, Tim Robbins? Okay, come on, man. You see this, sir? You go get a shadow band or whatever the the thing that it is when they, you know, we get regulated to the the, the lower depths of the internet. <laughs> I mean, I saw Rashida Jones. That's all I cared about. I mean, come on, man. So we got Rashida Jones. We got David o o Yellow. Um, Angela Yo, uh, we've got, um, you said Tim Robbins, we've got Ian Glenn, uh, Rebecca Ferguson, the boo, uh, and... Common. Yeah, Common. Uh, well, common. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So um, here's the thing. Rebecca Ferguson on IMDb is, only, is the only one listed for all the episodes. Mm-hmm. And other people are listed for like one or two or three. And maybe the only other person who's listed for more episodes, long, who's, who has the longest episodes, is Ian Glenn, which um, I don't know if you remember Ian Glenn, but yeah. um, he always plays a shitty scientist. Hashtag Resident Evil. Resident yeah. Evil. So whenever I see him, I'm like, oh, you're the bad guy. <laughs> yeah, it would be. Whenever you get those people who are always the bad guy, I always like it when they can kind of switch and be like, oh, I'm not the bad guy. I'm just here as a decoy to make you think I'm the bad guy. 
So that, that would be McDonald. great. Malcolm McDowell, yeah, another great bad guy. Whenever you saw him, he was always a bad guy. Michael Wincott, always a bad guy. Danny Houston, uh, always in a. Da oh, Danny Houston, I love him too. Yeah. I really wish he was more of a good guy sometimes. Um, wait, the only time he wasn't a bad guy was Children of Men. Okay. He was just part of the one percent, which some I mean, people would, some people like, would argue that still, was some people argue yeah. he's still the bad guy. Um, yeah, uh, I love Danny Houston. So you're you're um, the big sci-fi person among us. Do you know this the the source material this is based on or no? I do not. Okay. I saw this book series and then I went and looked it up a little bit and did, you know just did it like a quick and I was like, oh, this is interesting. And I stopped because I don't want the I don't want the the surprise ruined. Okay. So I don't. So I didn't. I didn't. I just saw it and I was like, oh, it's based on a book. And then I stopped because I was like, so that part where he goes, what if it all was a big lie? That part was in something that I saw, and so I stopped researching. I'm gotcha. like, I want to go into this fresh, not knowing. Kind of like how people went into The Last of Us, mm -hmm. who didn't play the game, who every week it's it's a it's a. <gasps> I kind of went in. I want to go into. I want to show like that. I want to show where I'm excited, and I don't know. And we're due for a big sci-fi show. We haven't had a well. I don't want to say we haven't. We've lost our big sci-fi show, which was Westworld. Mm -hmm. Big prestige sci-fi. Um, we've got the foundation. Um, uh, Chloe Martz has a show on Amazon, Peripheral. There's a couple of them right there on the Peripheral. But we need a big, big budget sci-fi whodunit, what's going on every week. And I hope this is the one. Yeah, I wonder if they're going to do any backstory and explain, oh, this is how the world got this way, or we're just in this world and we just live with it now. I'm wondering. I kind of want them to not know what happened. Mm -hmm. I want it to be kind of like a Matrix tape thing where it's like, we don't know what happened, but we know we we killed the sky and we struck first. Mm -hmm. Like, I kind of want, like, not necessarily like a backstory, but kind of a, you're, you're learning about the world as the show goes on because maybe that's part of the big lie. And for hold on, for those who have read the books and know what's happening, um, try not to spoil it for other people. Let, and, uh, let's let's not be dicks. Let's not be trolls. You know, let some people enjoy, and maybe that will get them to seek out the books. Because my brother, so backstory for my brother: when the movies came out for Hunger Games. He went back after he watched the first movie, read all the books. Hmm. Um, and same thing with my sister. She read all the Harry Potter books once the movie started coming out. So um, uh, I'm not, I read The Expanse before the show came out, but I want to go back and reread all the books now that the show is over. Okay. Um, so, yeah, so let's, let's all be shocked and surprised together. All right. Let's all be shocked and surprised together. You heard that from Leroy. Great advice to end this whole video on. Is this a show that you would watch, hmm? or is it too creepy for you? Is this a show you would watch, or is it too creepy? This isn't for you? creepy. This is fine. Okay. Yeah. I, I, I only asked that because I know you have a, a a strict policy on horror, and I didn't know if this ventured into it or no. When I think of horror, I think of like slasher type horror stuff. This doesn't. This oh, okay. Kind of like all right, sci-fi. That's fine. Alien franchise, Xenomorph, because you know that's getting a show and that's getting a movie. I'll leave that to you. Okay. You can just tell me about it. I'm like, oh, okay, cool. That's great. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm just checking. All right. Um, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, we want to hear from you. Let us know. Is this the new sci-fi show since uh, um, Raised by Wolves is no longer? It only got two seasons, got canceled. Uh, Westworld is gone. If you want to watch it, check it out on Tubi because they took it down on HBO Max. Um, if you want a sci-fi show, bill. just watch uh, For All Mankind. Man, that's good stuff. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Good call. Uh, also, good call. I forgot Apple about TV that. Bus, that's some good stuff right there. Hey, man, Apple TV is coming for HBO Max. They're like, hey, we ain't got a lot of shit, but it's good, and we're not canceling it. That's true. <laughs> and, we, and we're not taking it off either. Yeah. Uh, on that note, folks, we out. We got more videos to do. Peace. Deuces.